Hello everyone, welcome to my ERP video in which we will learn how you can resolve the error of SMTP not properly configured at the time of sending email. Basically, this error occurs sometimes after doing the email setup. When you send mail from the software and this error occurs due to some reasons, such as if we haven't mentioned the email service port correctly in the control room or we haven't enabled a few services of the Gmail account. That is of that Gmail which we are using to send email from the software, etc. So, in Mark ERP software, you can resolve the error of SMTP not properly configured. That occurs at the time of sending email by following the simple steps shown in the video. In which, first is check antivirus. Whenever an error of SMTP is shown to you, then firstly, you should check the antivirus because most of the time what happens is that the SMTP error appears due to the antivirus. As some antivirus doesn't support the software, then in this case, you should remove the antivirus from the software. Second, check SMTP port. In this case, you will check whether you have mentioned the correct SMTP port of the email service or not. You have to mention that email service port here, which you are using like for Gmail 465, for Yahoo, 465, for Hotmail, 467, etc. as it is given here. Third, you have to mention the app password in the Mark software which you need to generate from Gmail. Now, let's come and see how you can generate the app password from Gmail. For this, from your Google account, you will go to manage your Google account. Then from here, click on the security tab. Now click on the two steps verification option given here. Then click on get started. After that, mention your Gmail password here and click on the next tab. Then you will mention your mobile number here which you have linked with your Gmail account. And from here, you will select that whether you should receive the confirmation code through the text message or through call. Suppose we will tick the circle of text message and then click on the next tab. Then mention the code here which you have received in the text message. Now click on next. Then you will turn on the two step verification option. After that, you will again come to manage your Google account. Go to security. Then go to app passwords and click on it. Now again, Gmail password window will open. You will type your Gmail password here. Then here Gmail will ask you that for which app you are activating this app password. That is mail, calendar, contacts, YouTube, etc. So from the drop down, we will select mail. Then on the next window from the drop down, you will select the device that for which device you are generating the app password. So we will select Windows computer and from here, we will click on generate. Then Gmail will generate the app password, which will be shown to you only once. You will copy this password and save it with you for a safe site. Now, you have to mention this password in the software. For which, we will go to the Masters menu, then to Mark Setups and click on Control Room. And from here, click on Email or WhatsApp Setup field. Then click on the Accept tab. Then from this setup window, you will set this Want to Change Password field to Y from the drop down. Then this password window will open. You will mention the app password here and will press Enter. Then again, enter the same password. After this, by pressing escape key twice, you will click on yes on the save changes window and come back to the home screen of the software. In this way, you can update the changed Gmail password in your software. After doing all these settings, you can send mail to your customers from the software without any error. So friends, in this way, by following the steps shown in the video, you can resolve the SMTP error that occurs at the time of sending an email. Thanks for watching.